all right what is up guys welcome back to another video in this video i'm going to play tower defense simulator now yesterday tower defense simulator re released a brand new tower the brawler right here i just purchased him after grinding for quite a while but yeah um oh what's happening to me um okay. but yeah let's try this tower out uh, i'm just gonna use actually i'm not gonna use power man so i'm just gonna use golden scout for the uh, early defense or for the hidden detection i really don't know i've never seen this tower used ever and i haven't like watched any like reviews either so this is gonna be like the first you know <clears throat> so yeah let's try this out hopefully we'll win we'll just do a quick molten round and i'll show you what all levels do and look like so yeah let's load into the game real quick and what map should we do probably grass isle It was actually early defense. I don't need a skull. I know I don't need a scout, but I'm gonna farm anyway. Yeah, molten. Oh my god, bro! I'm, why, why am I not loading in? There we go. Now I am. Yeah, my. I can play some that right away, but I don't want to. Okay, so now I'm going to place my first brawler right here. Let's see what he does. Oh! Wow, oh, he does a lot of damage. 10 damage every 1.2 seconds? Dang. But he attacks pretty slowly. Which sucks. But he automatically has lead detection. This would, pretty, this would be pretty good for hardcore, I think. Dang, look at this guy. <coughs> yeah, let's upgrade him one time. Got some goggles on his head. Nice. He gets hidden detection and he gets attack combo. He's a three hit. Ooh, and he attacks so much faster once you upgrade this. And he's like, I guess, I guess we would say he's relatively early game. Not really, but like, he is pretty cheap to place. And, and, the, and on a map like Crossroads, he'll be pretty overpowered, I think. Let's upgrade him. Now he, now he, now he attacks really, really fast. Alright, come on. Yo, this is actually really good. What? <laughs> yeah, okay, I'm gonna upgrade my farms. But next, upgrade is $4,000. It's pretty expensive. And it gets pretty expensive quick, actually. I wonder how much his max level is. I'm gonna place one more next time. Actually, no. Farms. <clears throat> Okay, so if you guys haven't noticed, like, on his third attack, if he's against, like, a really strong guy, look, he just pushes them back. This is overpowered. What? Look at that. Bro, he killed him. That's crazy. Okay, let's upgrade him to pack a punch. Re -re 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 Reposition. Oh, this is what I saw in the, um... In like um the what you call it, TDS little uh, video, so he unlocks a reposition. Dang, and he gets more range. Dang, faster hydraulics. Finally, 100, 200 damage. He attacks so much faster and there's so much more. Bro, look at that knockback. That's insane, dude. Okay, I don't even need this guy back here. This is actually so good. What? New best tower? Question. And he has hidden detection and lead detection. That's like. All you need, it's like everything you need in one tower right here. Dang, bro. What's his DPS right now? Like, 100 probably? Because of the third punch, technically. Probably more. Hold oh, wait. Should I use his ability against these mysteries? Eh, I think, I think it's actually kind of a waste. I'm not going to do that. Dang, bro, look at this. He shoves them back. It's overpowered. Okay, I'm gonna see if they get faster hydraulics now. That, that, bro, that knockback is like crazy. Okay. <coughs> nice. Oh, bro, 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 he's so tall. What? 
This is kind of. Oh, oh wait, no, he has like little stilts now. <laughs> That's funny. I'm like, why is he so tall? This is overpowered, bro. He does 50 damage per hit, and in the final hit, does 200 damage. This is crazy. What is this DPS? I'm gonna, definitely gonna get a DJ back here for him. Like, put him right here, maybe. Dude, now, dude, now his range is really good. This is just overpowered, bro. What? This thing is definitely gonna get nerfed soon, honestly. This thing is, like, too good to, like, just... Or is like the new best speedrunning tower question mark? Could this be? I mean, it is insane. It looks so funny with the still stuff. Yeah, Max has what, 10 range? That's actually really good for, especially for a melee tower. Like, how does this reach? This really doesn't make any sense, but still, I ain't complaining. This thing is overpowered, and it's really, really cheap compared to most towers. Like, dang, bro. Oh, yeah, let's see how fast it can, can kill this slow boss over here. Oh, wait, the will be actually OP. Let's put them right here. See, like, how far I can push them back. Okay, just skip the wave. Could you like permanent? Like, could you like perma stun them and just like keep them in the thing? Dang, bro. Like, how far can you push them back? Okay, so at okay, so at level four, it just slows them down, but at max, it just shoves them back really far. I'm gonna max this one out over here. These guys have pain detection, right? Yeah, they do. Okay, this is just overpowered, bro. What even is this? This is so good. Wait a minute, I'm gonna try this guy's ability and move him right here. Yo! Same for this guy. Max him out and move him right here. Dang, bro. This is so cool. I love this tower. You can like actually wait a minute, can four of them like solo the entire game? That would actually be a really cool thing. If it could. But it's super cheap and so it's super spammable. Like I wonder if there's a place in the limit. Like Gladiator doesn't, I think. So I wonder if this has a placement limit. Probably it does, because then it would be way too powerful. And it already is broken. Play some commanders now. Honestly, I bet you could win like a molten with just commander, DJ, and brawler. Like honestly, not even farm. I mean, may may maybe you might need farm, but still. Let's see if we can play some more. Speedy boss instantly gone, bro. What? Instant. Dude. What? This is too good. Like, I'm, like, I'm not even trying to glaze it, but this is just insane. What? Okay, I'm gonna turn auto skip on to see how fast we can get through this game. I can also put them back here, right? Yeah, damn. So, uh, bro, all, all, already it's not sick, so I don't think it does have a placement. May, may, maybe it doesn't, I'm slow, but still. Like, I'd expect it to be six, because look at this, bro. Nothing can move. Literally, nothing is, like, even allowed to move, bro. 
Like, I haven't seen, like, an enemy come out of there in so long. Strength in numbers! Strength in numbers! I love the new command everywhere. I'm probably, probably going to make a video on that soon, but that did happen a while ago. And really, nothing really changed, because what they did was they removed the Call of Arms, the, the, I mean, the ability to uh, chain the Call of Arms, because the, uh, the cooldown was 40 seconds for like a day. But then it got so much hate that I'm pretty sure they changed it back. And right now it's it's only better because they also at a max level it spawns like a tank now. I can show you that real quick. Yeah, he just screams and then yeah. I'm pretty sure every skin has like a different tank skin, which is cool. There's one gunner and two missiles. Oh no, two gunners and one missile. But yeah, still pretty cool. <coughs> And also the skins got really rough. And this Galactic skin is like my favorite so far. There he goes, the first enemies that finally came out in a long time. I mean, we gotta put more brawlers down. Just broken, dude. I can't, I can't believe this is a tower, bro. This is like Toxic Gunner when it first released. It could like stun anything. Okay, I'll see these gunners destroy them. Nope, they're just being wasted because the brawlers are shredding everything. Do I even need farms at this point? Honestly, I can just sell my farm right now. I don't even need it. Yeah, there's a farm. Let me put some more brawlers. Oh, I can't fit one there. Not even here. Okay, I'm gonna put one more there. Oh, only 10 brawlers. Okay, you know what? That, that actually doesn't make sense. But... It, it, it needs to be bumped down to like six to be honest like like, like it, it, even i can say that this is just too powerful let's see if we can take out the molten boss with just brawlers if, if it needs health i'll probably put some golden scouts like down back here maybe i don't think it's gonna need help though yeah it's destroying these titans they have 3500 health each and it's and it's immune to being stunned and, and i can move these around Holy, bro, I just realized how OP this is. Oh my god, I forgot I can move them around. Oh, and I can also spawn tanks. Yeah, they're all screaming. Oh my god, so many tanks. It's like a, it's like a train of tanks. <coughs> yeah. Let's see how fast we can destroy these guys. I have so much money right now. Mol okay, the molten boss is here. Let's do this. Destroy the weed! Destroy the weed! Kill him, kill him, kill him! Destroy him! Oh, I forgot the gunners are here! Get him! Oh, yeah. These bows are immune to getting stunned. Okay, they're shredding him. It's fine. Because, because we can also move them around. Okay. Nice. Look at this. No. Oh, is... Wait, he's already dead? What? Okay, this needs a nerf. Like, I'm not even lying, dude. This needs a nerf. It's so cheap and overpowered. That's like, what? Okay, okay. I'm just lost for words, man. You, this is better than Accelerator and Engineer combined. Double that. And it's only 1,000 gems. Guys, I highly recommend you guys grind for this and get this tower as soon as you can before it gets nerfed. And, and it only takes, like, what, three hours to, 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 to get this tower if you use a pro strat but yeah thank you guys so much for watching make sure to like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in, in the next video peace